The state of Ohio allowed high school sports teams to compete through next Wednesday on a trial basis, after which the policy will be reevaluated. But as Anjanette Levy tells us, some athletes are concerned about the virus and wonder what sports will look like in the fall. As members of St. Xavier High School's soccer team get ready for practice, they're masked up. But during practice, the masks come off and the bombers are spaced out in separate assigned practice pods. Goalie Briggs O'Toole is getting ready for his last season at St. X in the middle of the pandemic. It always worries me, but um, I feel like that I'm taking the proper precautions, wearing masks, keeping my distance. The bombers shut down football practice for two weeks after some players tested positive for COVID-19. Those in charge of sports are now coaching athletes and their families on preventing the spread of the virus. It's a new normal, so to speak, for the kids because they're not used to it. They're used to being close. They're used to being together and connected. And, you know, unfortunately, this is this has required a lot of education and, and not just education, but constant reminders to the kids that, hey, back up, back up every day. We're saying that keep your space from your from your friends right now. Right now, there are still a lot of questions about what happens during the season if a player gets sick. Of course, that player would have to isolate. So what does that mean? for the team's schedule and their record. There's no playbook, there's no guidebook for, for what you do. You know, we're certainly waiting for direction from the state of Ohio and especially the OHSAA about that. Athletic Director Brian Reinhardt says they're using advice from the County Health Department and the CDC to keep everyone safe, including temperature checks before practice. Briggs O'Toole feels his teammates are doing whatever they can to stay healthy. Right now we're trying to do our best to get ready for the season and um, stay prepared. In Springfield Township, Anjanette Levy, Local 12 News. The Ohio High School Athletic Association released a statement this week saying that it is operating as if sports will happen in the fall. It's working on guidance to pass along to schools.